you're going to create an anti-bullying Animoto presentation. And this assignment's going to be called In Three Words. Okay, so at the top, I show you some commercials that are listed here. Um, and you probably recognize at least some of them. Notice that they're using short all of these three words they're very short they're just three words but you likely remember these they stick with you so the point is you can say a lot you can make a big statement only using three words so you're going to use three words to make your own slogan you're going to make an anti-bullying campaign slogan so it's going to feel kind of like a commercial okay just like these are commercials a campaign slogan, a campaign is usually talking about um, some kind of commercial. All right, so then I've broken this down into three days. Yes, you have four days to do this, but I've broken it down into three so that you could be done by the end of the day Thursday and focus more on things that you need to get caught up on on the last day of the quarter. Or you can stretch this out over four days and some of you may be starting this late. You may not be able to get to it until Wednesday. So either way, I'm gonna leave it set up as three days, even though you technically have four days to do this. All right, so first section, you guys can all read this to yourself. Um, but they're talking here about uh, different slogans, what you can think of. You're gonna watch a clip from GMA, Good Morning America. Okay, you're going to do a little research, and then that's going to be day one. Day two. Day two, you're going to decide on your slogan. You're going to start figuring out how to put your three words to music in a presentation. Again, think an ad campaign. Uh, in the Animoto that you're going to do, you're limited to 30 seconds which is perfect because that's how long a commercial is. Okay, so you're creating some kind of like anti-bullying commercial, so campaign. Think about using pictures, video, whatever it is you can think of to add to your, uh, to your Animoto. You're gonna create an Animoto account and you're gonna start planning out the pieces. And that'll be day two. Day three, you're going to build all your pieces. Okay, and then either you can go to a fourth day and compile it, put it into Animoto then, or you can go ahead and do it on the third day. Your choice. So I'm giving you step-by-step -step directions on what you need to do when you're finished with your Animoto. Animoto is super easy to use. It's just point and click. Um, it, it's very easy. You just click, drag, drop. It's very simple. Okay, and then the assignment on the next page, again, helps you with um, what you need to do when you're done and ready to submit. It's also got the rubric please make sure you check the rubric. I'm looking at your content. I'm looking at your images. So you should have images. I'm looking at your music. I'm looking at your three words and then your overall presentation.